Ladies and gentlemen, welcome along the Tonks and Tails. Been joined by Stephen Bunton. Thanks for joining us, Stephen. After that's a tough one to take, but a tremendous game against Raymond Van Barneveld. A fantastic game. Um, everyone sees what it meant to me at the end. Um, the the tears were, were all of joy, really. No no sad tears. Such a fantastic game, and um, when Raymond said all the nice things about <laughs> yeah. me, I just couldn't hold it back, really. <laughs> no, I mean there's, he hurt you with a couple of. Uh, well, seen massive checkouts, but the one two four, the one one three, and the, I think the one oh seven. Just the right sort of time for him. That, that, well, that was the difference. There, there wasn't any difference between you two, really. Averages and you know, yeah, it was it was a really tight game. I think the one two four he took out when um, I had a bounce out on the ball. I think he did. He did several twenty and missed the thirty two, but uh, no, it was, I'm really happy with with the way I performed. Um, not just tonight, but throughout the whole tournament. Yeah. I've had a fantastic tournament. If if someone would have said to me, "Would you take quarter final?" <laughs> I'd have quite happily snapped everyone's hand off um, yeah. with the draw I had. And yeah. no, it it it's all a learning curve for me as well. This is my first um, William Hill World Championship, and um, there's going to be many more. Yeah, that, that's right. I mean, instead of the players you played, I mean, James and, and, and Michael and, and, and Raymond. So next year, of course, you've got to build on this because, as I say, it's been such a fantastic year in, in all the events. So, but what a way to settle down in. Hey, it's got to be the Premier League, hasn't it? It's got to be. It's got to be the Premier League. It's got to be. And that, that, that just top the year off, really. Um, that'd be fantastic if I, can, if I can push myself into the Premier League after the year I've had. Um, it'd be a, a dream come true, really, playing playing in Liverpool as well, yeah. in front of me, me, uh, my home crowd and everything. Yeah. It'd be fantastic, but. Uh, I won't think too much about that until uh, until Mr. Barry um, goes through the go ahead. But uh, no, no, it's as I said, it's been a fantastic year. I've I've played really well on the TV. Mm. I've done decent on the floor as well, and um, yeah, I've got a lot to build on for next year. Yeah, you you look comfortable out there. Do, do, do you feel comfortable out there, Steve? You, you... I felt really comfortable, apart from um, obviously when Barney said all them nice things. <laughs> I got a bit emotional, but uh, no, during the match, I felt really comfortable. Um, Barney was in 180s for fun really and I just couldn't, my first travel was going in, the next one was just going just underneath but credit to Raymond, um, five times world champion, what a fantastic player and uh, I couldn't have wished to uh, to have lost to to a nicer person yeah, really. That, that, that sums it up and of course it wasn't tears, what Raymond said of course it was the fact that Stephen Gerrard is leaving Liverpool, that's what it's all about, well Stephen on a serious note thank you so much for the entertainment you give us over the last week or so, ladies and gentlemen my name is Paul Starr, that's the bullet Stephen Bunton, that's Tungsten Tales, an association with Unicorn, keeping you at the sharp end of the world, thanks for joining us. Thank you.